And new tonight, setting new limits on pot smoking. The Denver City Council deciding where you can light up on private property depends on how visible you are from the street or sidewalk. Jacqueline Allen is live, and Jacqueline, no one knew how this vote would go until it was made. That's right, a very passionate meeting here tonight. Opponents call this unenforceable. Supporters say it protects kids and neighborhoods. Here's the vote tonight. Five nays, seven ayes. The amendment passes. That's right, the final vote, five against it, seven for it on first reading. This after almost two and a half hours of public comment. We heard concerns about enforceability. DPD's Chief Wipe said citing people for smoking on their property would be very low priority. Others were concerned about private property rights. But Councilwoman Jeannie Robb proposed the amendment. And she says there are restrictions already on where people smoke cigarettes and drink alcohol, too. Actually, our penalties are less than for the consumption of alcohol. So I think we hit the balance. And the chief of police basically said this is going to be low priority and difficult to enforce. I mean, is this unenforceable? I don't think it's unenforceable. I think there will be citations in a year. I don't think there'll be a ton of citations. You know, I'm really disappointed because I do think it is an attempt to roll back what people uh, voted for when they voted for Amendment 64, and that was for consumption, you know, on private property. So if this passes on final vote next week, people wouldn't be able to smoke marijuana anywhere where they could be seen from streets or sidewalks. That means people's front yards, their backyards, if they don't have a privacy fence, anywhere where they could be seen doing it. Reporting live, Jacqueline Allen, 7 News.